My name is Benedict Tosu. Welcome to the sports segment here on Join News Today. Now, it's uh, just about 48 hours to the bout between Bukum Banku and Bastes Samer, his challenger. Now, Banku is undoubtedly the more popular of the two, but who is Bastes Samer? Now, the 31 year old boxer from Northern Ghana has a rich amateur background and wants to replicate it in his professional career. As usual, Nathan Alato, who is on the Joy Sports Boxing Beat, tells us more about Bastes Samer. In today's edition of the Joy Sports Boxing Diaries, we take a close look at Basti Samer, a 2008 Olympian who has gone 16 fights undefeated, 15 of them coming by way of wins and one by a draw. He's yet to taste defeat, just like his opponent Bukum Banku. One interesting thing that has emerged in the build-up to this fight is the fact that some supporters of Bukum Banku have defected to his camp. He explains this phenomenon. Uh, like they go to uh, Banku gym and they see Banku training, and after they will come to our gym. Yeah, when they see us training, they change their mind. Uh, everyone would come and watch me fight uh, training. They don't know that this guy is not going to last. One of his biggest credentials as an up-and-coming boxer and a potential champion is the fact that he. He is a previous sparring partner of the legendary Floyd Mayweather Jr. He says experiences from the Mayweather gym in Las Vegas, Nevada, have toughened him up for challenges ahead. He sparred one of two people, and I was the last guy he sparred with. First, first sparring, we sparred two rounds, he's like, it's enough. And next day, and when he came to the gym, he chose me, he's like, hey, let's go. Time off, 50 rounds straight, you know? You, you guys fought 15 rounds in training. Time off. So after we finish sparring, and 50 cents come and hug me, he's like, yo, you are doing good. You know, but this is the time I have to do something for myself, you know. Well, Basti surely is determined to make a point come October 21. So the boxing bout is happening this coming Saturday at the Bukum Boxing Arena here in Accra. Now we have to shift from boxing and do some football. Black Star Let's coach Pax Fabian is happy with his team's progression to the quarterfinals of the ongoing FIFA and the 17 World Cup in India. Now goals from Captain Eric Eia and Richard Danso gave Ghana a 2-0 win over Niger in a run of 16 tie yesterday. Now the team had so many chances uh, to you know, kill off the game, including a penalty that was fluffed uh, along the lines. Coach Fabian, who expressed delight with their play, says they can only get better as the tournament progresses. Definitely, we, we are here. Everybody, I believe every team that has qualified has that mentality to, to win the trophy. So we are also thinking when, to, when Africans will play each other, we know each other so well, and therefore it's, it's very difficult. Even though we could have scored so many goals, it was a little bit difficult in the beginning until the penalty came and I mean calmed our nerves. So it's going to be another KG encounter, but we are prepared for any any anything. So that was coach of the Black Star Let's team Park with Fabian speaking after his sight uh, victory of at Niger yesterday in a round of 16 ties. So they were, uh, they've qualified to the next stage of the competition. That's the quarterfinals, and they will be up against the Mali. Uh, that's going to happen, God willing, Saturday. So Ghana, Mali is happening Saturday, 11.30. On the same Saturday, we have the USA, England. That's also another quarterfinal game. Then on Sunday, two matches will be Spain, Iran, and Germany will come up against Brazil. Now we are building up to the Joy Sports uh, Invitational Tournament, which will be held, God willing, next Saturday. So if you're a company out there and you're interested in participating, just make your way to Joy FM and pick up a form. You only pay 1,000 Ghana CDs uh, as participation fee. So the Joy Sports Invitational Tournament, you get to hear more on radio and see more here on TV as well as online. Join us at 2. Nathaniel Lato will come your way with Sports Today, where we'll, get, we'll have more sports stories for you. My name is Benedict Tosu. Thanks so much for your company.